guys welcome back to our channel so today we have a gentleman here from the diaspora and he wants to you know have a conversation with us hi how hi. are you hey how you doing i'm good please what's your name oh my name is steve steve okay uh -huh. um is this your first time in ghana yes yeah, okay which country are you coming from uh from the u.s from the u.s yep. okay when you were in the u.s when they mentioned the name ghana uh -huh. what comes to mind uh the year of return uh historical significance uh -huh. and uh place where everything's natural uh, okay. weather's great amazing people okay all right so what motivated you to come to ghana it's always been something that that anyone of uh of color actually wants to connect with all of us okay. you know we're all the same so yeah there's a lot of motivation uh, Ghana's Kwame Nkrumah, a lot of historical figures, Kofi mm -hmm. So yeah, it, it makes sense. All right, that's great to know. A lot of people uh, believe, like Black Americans, believe that their roots are from Africa, and some of them have particular countries that they believe their forefathers came from. Yeah. Do you have any idea where which country you come from? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so uh, my roots are Kenyan. So, wow. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. I mean, we're all the same. We just migrated to different countries. We're not created by us. We're created by other people. Yeah. So we're really all the same. And uh, well, people need to think that way and you know, open their eyes, read history a little bit more. Yeah. yeah. All right. Coming to Ghana, what what one thing have you noticed here that you think should be, uh, you know, improved upon? Okay, yeah. so Ghanaian people are amazing, extremely nice. I think the government needs to work on uh, really doing a better job in, in working on infrastructure. Tax is high, but you don't see where the tax money is going. It's going, exactly. Um, I mean, as an outsider, it's apparent. Tax is double digits, it's really high. Um, so, other than that, if young people of Ghana can come together and maybe you know, push for their rights to be realized, I think we'll have a better country and a better continent together. That's great. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I also want to ask, being in Ghana, what's your experience so far with the Ghanaian people? Awesome. It's nice. You're nice. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. What's your favorite food in Ghana? Have you tasted any food yet? Oh my gosh, there's a lot. It's not just one. Yeah, okay. Yeah, Can I mention good. any of those foods that you tasted? I can't think of anything specific. But just have you just tasted a Ghana jollof? Yes. <laughs> Ghanaian, Nigerian. I know that argument. I'm not going to comment on that. Okay. <laughs> but have you tasted fufu? Uh, not Ghanaian. No. You've not tasted anything Ghanaian yet. Not Ghanaian fufu. Okay, yeah. but Nigerian. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So I only okay. have one baseline. I can't compare yet. I want to ask, what idea do you think is in the US that you can, you know, import here to Ghana? Yeah. To be it? honest, mm -hmm. everything in the US, mm -hmm. a lot of people on the ground are thinking of the same things here. Mm -hmm. um, people just need to connect with each other more and help mm -hmm. each other innovate together and not yeah. individually. Okay. Yeah. That, that's that's my honest mean. opinion. Okay. Any advice to uh, people living in the diaspora who are thinking about coming to Africa or Ghana? What advice do you have to give them? Do your research and mm -hmm. uh, just uh, save your money take a trip and connect with people that's all all right yeah. thank you so much right, i'm you. so happy to meet you all right, your name again uh steve steve yeah. okay thank you so much thank you so really much. appreciate, your appreciate it all right <laughs> bye, bye. <laughs> all right guys like i told you this is the most visited tourist attraction here in the center of accra as you can see those people are just arriving that's the car that's brought them they are obviously people from the diaspora as you can see they are definitely not uh, residents here in Ghana and all the students here too they are from Kumasi let me ask one of them to tell us hi how are you what's your name speak loudly my name is Sarah yeah, it's Yeah, it's Okay, which region are you coming from? 
Asante, Asante region. So, are you a student? Is the group a, a, a group of students or the NCC? NCC, National Commission for Civic Education. Oh, okay. Mm, are you on sort of an excursion or something? Okay. Is this your first time coming here? Do you know the name of this place? What's the name? The Independence Square. Okay. And, and also the Black Star Square. Before they were calling it the Independence Square, but now they call it the Black Star Square. What do you want to be in the future when you grow up? A doctor. That means you have to study hard. You need to study hard, right? Whatever they teach you at school, when you go home, you make sure you revise it. When you keep reading, you have to read a lot. Doctors, hey, they are sharks, so they learn so much. So you need to study, make good grades. It's only with good grades that you can enter the university to do medicine. So, yeah. So I just want to know the name of your school. The name of my school is. Jacobo SDDHS. Ah, uh, Jacobo SDDHS. Is that where? Jacobo. Okay, in the Ashanti uh, region. Uh, SDA. SDA. Oh, okay. All right, thank you. Nice talking to you. But this guy, is this supposed to be Uber or. Which one? Yours. Yes. Uh, bro, you've been from the bridge since you got it, or even uh, <laughs> no, yeah. these days I've been getting this sort of uh, you know cars on this road a lot. Yeah, you know, uh -huh. if you have a car, you can't get it. Uh -huh. Then you just be using it, then you just go in here, you come in here, and you get your food. Oh, okay, you better use it for oh, okay, it. yeah, so, uh, uh, that's uh, a strategy. Uh, once I pay, yeah, yeah. It's a paper for commercial and insurance. Okay. It is your road ready to commercial. Mm -hmm. But for the lack of marriage of some of the My people drivers, perish. Taxi drivers, <laughs> they tell you know, these people, they are bad. And they will give me a court uh, statement. Mm. Again, say, hey, oh, give me someone who already took someone's bag and. They be looking for their driver. Oh, some of it oh, those are they are not printed uh, taxi. Mm -hmm. They are bad. They are thieves. Mm -hmm. Ah, who is who is it? Uh, <laughs> that's what they print you. Oh, they print you for that. Yes. Yeah. Ah, because they know you are you are spoiling their way. They are you are spoiling their market. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody is spoiling uh, somebody's <laughs> market. But yeah, you know what? Yeah. When you leave it for them, you can't eat all. <laughs> hey, so hey, go back to that. Oh, come on.